Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, <clears throat> and welcome to the 12 Bong Show coming to you from our tour bus. And my name is Ray Dolan, and we are starting off a week, another week, and we have a, our different t shirt on from Mullingar <clears throat> in Mullingar. Busy weekend we had, and as you can see, the stop signs in the background as well. So I uh, hope you're all keeping well and enjoying. Um, the fantastic weather that we're having here, especially all our friends looking in from around Mullingar. Today is the 27th of March, and uh, next week is going to be April. And once again, the months are flying by, January, February, March. And to all our friends looking in, hello, Bridget. So let's start off our show. It's coming to you in association with Mullingar Autos. <coughs> I'm a little bit hoarse because it's been a very, very busy weekend. The show is called The Twelve Bongs, and we'd like to thank Gareth from New York for introducing our show. Bong, 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 bong. Bong, bong. Big shout out to you, Marie Kelly, looking in there from downtown Mullingar. And Joseph Gagan is looking in as well. Feel free to hit the share button and let it off to more friends to introduce them to our 12 Bong show. And as well as that, we have a show at five o'clock called The Bus Sessions. And we're going over two years of The Bus Sessions, singing a song every day. Now, uh, yes, indeed, uh, our video vault was today was from Jim Burke Mullingar Autos, and that brings us back to 2020, which is now is 2022. <coughs> okay, messages coming in here big time. What we'll do is we will um, we'll get back to our messages. Thanks very much for the 15th message. Hopefully, to get to see you soon. That's Martina Collin. Hello, Martina, and great to know you're watching in. We met all your family in Cor in from Cork in Killarney on <clears throat> on Friday night, and uh, that was a mission indeed down to Killarney and back. Okay, let's continue. Roger Nicholson, uh, congratulations on your retirement as well as your birthday. And Patsy Dixon is looking in there from Rathwire. It's your birthday as well. And James McGrath is looking in from Mullingar. Happy birthday to you. Ger Butler is looking in from downtown Mullingar and it's your birthday. And Aidan O'Rourke in Limerick, originally from Mullingar. It's your birthday. And Jantra, it's your birthday. And she's here in Mullingar. And we have Martin Cahill looking in from Mullingar. Big shout out to you on your birthday. Marina Murphy is looking in from Port Leash. A big happy birthday to you. And Amber Leaf, L-E-A-F-E, -E, who is in Athlone. It's your birthday. And a lad called Joe Bloggs. How are you, Joe? Great to know you're watching in. And a big birthday wish to you. David McCormick is looking in from Mullingar. Hello to you. And Trevor McDonald. It's your birthday. And Kenny Bean. It's your birthday too, and he's in Mullingar. And Anne Moore, big shout out to you on your birthday. And uh, Kevin, uh, Jedi King is looking in there as well, because yesterday it was Kaylee, his daughter's birthday. So big shout out to you all in the Netherlands. And Ross Brady looking in from Mullingar. <coughs> it's your birthday, Ross. Happy birthday to you. Now we have GAA Jackpot Lotto draws and uh, they are all literally running this evening and uh, the downs <clears throat> they're giving away for 2400 in their um virtual draw it's um <clears throat> a jackpot lotto very very simple indeed all you have to do is go to the facebook page pick out where the link is drop a few pound into the link pick a couple of numbers and voila you are away in a hack, you are in. You can do this from your car and you can win it from your car because they will whoosh, send it to you if you win the same way as you've done it virtually. So, very simple thing to do and uh, a lot of people in the world are getting involved in the lotto with the downs. Now, today they have their lotto. It's going around 6.30. If you have to be in by 6.30, they will pick the numbers around 8 o'clock. Now, Kalukan GAA, they have their big jackpot lotto again, 13,000. It doesn't move, but it's always there. It could be yours very simply. 
we have Multifarnham, GAA Lotto. Oh, my God, they had it last night and I didn't check. Um, if they can send me in the information, I'd really, really appreciate it for the Multifarnham GAA Lotto. Um, they were uh, 12,800 last night. Wow, what a huge number. And Shandona had their jackpot lotto on Thursday. So it'll be this Thursday coming up. There's 4,100 euros in that for your collection. And Joan Byrne won 100 euros because she picked three numbers. Now, uh, the rugby club have their lotto jackpot on tonight. It's 2,300. And as we said, it could be yours. It could be yours very, very simply by just picking a couple of numbers. Yeah, virtually going in there and checking it out, dropping in a few pounds, and lo and behold, the money will be sent to you if you win. Now, our food shout out competition winner is the Grove Cafe. And uh, what a beautiful spot it is on Grove Street, just behind um, Mojo's and Jolie around the same area Jolie's hairdressers and as well as that our face book page recommendation is Shane Turner Shane Turner arrived in town last week he's a man from South Africa but living in Balnehown and he is an artist of um he is he's an award winning artist and he has put up a mural on the wall just between um the auctioneers and the post office on Dominic Street. Uh, he has been spray painting this. Now it's not a simple thing to do. He spray painted the wall there. And um, there was something there before. There was a lot of the local artists on it. But what they've done this time is um, they have put up Nile Horn. Um, sort of like with his guitar sideways like this. And a crowd. It's like a big selfie. It's all on the wall and it's spray painted over the last three or four weeks. And uh, fair play to you, Shane Turner, award-winning artist. So if you're in Mullingar, or if you know someone in Mullingar, and get them to take a picture of it, you might take a picture of it itself and put it up. Um, check out this artist. And if you need some amazing work done, a mural or something like that, he does a show as well. An amazing, amazing character. So check out his Facebook page. That is our Facebook page recommendation. Shane Turner, award-winning artist. Now, shop local pick of the day is Me Owl Flower. And that's Mrs. Bouquet. <laughs> And she is in Black Hall and what a collection of beautiful, beautiful flowers for a beautiful day that it is today. And an amazing weekend as well. Now, what else have we got for you? Oh, the fla is on the way, folks. The 31st of July till the 7th of August. A full week of traditional music bringing it all back home because literally it started here in Mullingar. Now, there's a big call out for um, houses and rooms they're needed to um, give to people, uh, probably rent to them as well in the Mullingar area. So if you're in the Mullingar area and you'd like to rent your house or um, give up some rooms to the FLA that is on the way, go to their Facebook page and just say that you're available and uh, you, you, you'll be able to help out in some shape or form towards the FLA. It's a huge committee, uh, a huge, what would you say, a huge commitment for the committee and um, a huge committee from a huge commitment from all the local people to make this a huge success. So we're really, really looking forward to it. And uh, the local um, participation is amazing. And um, fair play to everyone involved. Now, uh, Collinstown Farmers Market is on on the third of April, which is next Sunday. And uh, that's going to be a great, great day. So check that one out. And a big shout out to, uh, oh, the Mullingar hikers they're headed to Scotland. And they headed up Ben Nevis. And you know what? They gave us a big shout out from the top of Ben Nevis. So Ken and all the crew, thank you very, very much indeed. Now we have more information for you here. We have uh, on the 31st um, of this month, which is Thursday, we're going to be going live at Hydrate Alkaline Water and Wellness Centre in Ballinalac. And as you know from previous weeks, we've had some of the members of the crew from this uh, amazing company here um, just outside Mullingar. And uh, we're going to be going live there on Thursday. So check that one out. And if you'd like to call down yourself, you're very welcome to call in. It's a demonstration and uh, um, sort of a... A welcome 
they're having one of these a month in Balnalak and um, check it out there folks go to hydrate alkaline water and wellness store check out the Facebook page and come out on the evening of Thursday now what else have we got we've got uh, Tullin Alley they're back open again the tea room is ready to rock and it's going to open on this weekend and we've been invited out there as well this weekend um, by Mr Doyle and uh, hopefully we're going to get out there well we will get out there I think he wants us out on Saturday so a um, big shout out to all our friends out there in Tullin Alley Castle and uh, uh, well um, we're looking forward to having the tea and the buns on Saturday now Love Richard Anthony food. Love food from Richard Anthony. He has um, <clears throat> his competition run at the moment. I'm not too sure if it's open or over, but uh, go to his Facebook page and check that one out. As well as that, Margaret Smith he has a charity walk out in Mullamead um, Forest. It's just the far side of Castle Pollard. And for the last 20 years, and it's M U L L A G H Mulla Mead. And she has this walk and it's on on the 2nd of April and it's in solidarity with Charlie Bird, who is going to be climbing Crow Patrick on the same day. Now, he has his charities as well. And if you want to get involved and go on the walk, um, go to Margaret Smith's page. And uh, it's on the 2nd of April, 11 o'clock. I'm be invited that as well. It's going to be a busy, busy weekend. Um, hopefully we'll get to that around 11 o'clock and then maybe get to Tullinally Castle for the tea after. Not a bad idea. Ken Smullen Food Appeal. It doesn't stop with Ken and his amazing volunteers. They are collecting dry food for people who need it here between Mullingar and Tullamore. Would you believe it? A lot of children are going to school hungry and we are a first world country. We are a first world country and we have kids going to school hungry. Tell us about it, lads. Now, Ken seen this problem and uh, he started to collect dry food. And now he's over a thousand people ringing him. Uh, can you drop some food down? It's amazing, isn't it? It's shocking. Anyway, if you'd like to help out, go to Deals of Mullingar, buy some dry food. And there's a little shopping area they can just drop it into. And Ken and his amazing volunteers will collect this. Probably himself will collect it. And he will distribute it during the weekend to the people that need it. So if you'd like to get involved or go to Ken Smullen's Food Appeal page and find out some drop zones that you can dry, dr drop some dry food into them places as well. So once again, to Ken and your crew, um, hats off to you all. Now, if you'd like to join us on board the bus to tell your story, promote your business or have a bit of crack, you're very, very welcome indeed. My name is Ray Dolan. Our show is called The Twelve Bongs. And we are delighted that you take the time to join us at 12 o'clock, five days a week. And uh, join us as well with our bus sessions at five o'clock. It's 12 o'clock. Did I say 12 or five? It's 12 o'clock for this show, The Twelve Bongs. And it's five o'clock ish ish for the bus sessions. Now, we're going to have a quick look back through all the messages. And all the people who are joining us here. And anyone left a message, we're going to say a big hello to them. Now, Bridget Nielsen's after writing to us, and she's in England. And she said, good afternoon, Ray, and everyone on the bus. Have a great day. Well, you're a legend. Thank you for that. And Marie Kelly from downtown Mullingar has uh, sent us a message as well. And uh, good morning to you. We have Ben Redwan, who wrote to us from North Africa. He says, hello, Ray, and everyone on the bus. Thanks, Ben. And um, Bernie O'Neill looking in from Ballymahan. You're very welcome. And she's after writing to us as well. Paul McCudden and uh, Martina Cullen says, Hello, Ray. Thanks so much for the 50th, 15th message. Hopefully we will get to see you soon. Oh, that was on the 15th. Maybe that's what it is. Valentina is on board the whole way from Bucharest. Have a happy Monday and a great week. Thank you very much. And that's a big message from Valentina right to us from Bucharest. Paul McCudden says, Hi Ray, happy sunny Monday. It definitely is. And uh, Marina McDermott is looking in from London and she writes, Happy afternoon, Ray. Shane Turner is on board. Good man, Shane, you legend. Uh, we'll have to have a look down there. Are you still working away, Shane? Have you got a few? And said, amazing work that you're doing in Mullingar. Uh, Karina Ball is looking in the whole way from Holland. 
and uh, she's an hashtag from Mullingar, Mullingar. Just started watching in, and uh, she said nothing, but she's watching in. And who else do we have? Derek and Karen looking the wind the whole way from who in North Wales. You're very welcome, and thanks for taking the time to write to us. Uh, Valentina says hello, Ben. Hello, Sally Taylor, and hello, Derek and Karen. And what else is written down here? The electric cars are very quiet. Shh. Pass them by. Uh, did you notice that with electric cars? You could look up behind you so easy and then you go, Oh, that's a car. <laughs> now, what else we got? We've got Una McCudden. Happy Monday, Ray, and everybody on the bus. Thank you very much, Una, and great to know that you are with us today. Ah, uh, yes, I think all the messages. Nora Anna's watching in, Nora. Paula McCudden says, Una McCudden's, hi, sister, happy Monday. <laughs> See, that's what happens. Everyone's on the bus now. It's pretty, isn't it? Uh, yes, I'm Terry on board. And hello to you, Sally's in Derry. And Lizzie Farrell, who was at the show. 